Teens age 12 and older have been able to get the Pfizer vaccine for almost a month now. CBS 4's Bryce Helms spoke with health officials to find out how the vaccination turnout is shaping up in the RGV. The Rio Grande Valley was one of the hardest hit regions during the height of the COVID-19 pandemic. Everyone's been touched uh, down here directly or indirectly by the tremendous impact that we've had during the last year. And so everyone knows the stuff we went through. Now, communities along the U.S.-Mexico border have the highest percentage of people 12 and over with at least one dose of the COVID-19 vaccine in the state of Texas. One out of every nine households, three generational, a one out of every three uh, bedrooms in the county, people are more than one person sleeping in them. So we knew they were important as carriers of this disease, especially when 80% were completely asymptomatic. Hidalgo County Health Authority Dr. Yvonne Melendez says the number of teens getting the COVID-19 vaccine is on track to where we should be after a month. We've had thousands. Uh, of, uh, you know, last, uh, what, a week ago, there was over 4,000 vaccines that were given to the population group. So I think it's a pretty good number. Um, I think it's only going to increase. Melendez says continued vaccinations of young teens is important for everything to return to normal. We had to capture those people that were less than 18 years old in order for us to reach that statistical mathematical number. So it's crucially important for us to get community global immunity to capture the, this particular age group. Working for you in Harlingen, I'm Bryce Helms.